Okay. Yes, I haven't seen it either. 40K is not right. Not right for a short film. And because numerous reasons. First, this was the first project that I worked on as a production assistant. If you see uh, around here, Malcolm Jamal Warner is a part of it. Denise Staus, she's an actress, wanted to take her hand at directing. Um, and many other familiar faces. Uh, this is Derek Morgan, by the way. It's just Hugh Dane. Like, all these, all these fantastic people. And they definitely did not spend 40K or anything close to 40K back in the day. So I didn't get paid for that project as a production assistant, and that project was really low budget. All of that project was made through connections. So hearkening back to your previous comment about the marketing, what would have been better instead of dropping 40K on a project and spending all that money, you could hire quality people that are already following you, bringing them on board and putting in the contract that, hey, help me promote this. And when you promote this, I will promote you and you get to gain more follow followers. It's mutually beneficial and it's networking. It's connection oriented. And this is key in the film industry. If you do not get networking in the film industry, you're not going to be in the film industry. It is all about networking and who you know, who you affiliate with and helping each other climb up the ladder. So he definitely should not have dropped 40 K on the short film project, especially with his reaction being the expectation that he's going to have all of his followers like suddenly pay all this money for it. And, you know, like he could have had so much more reach had he just invited people to contribute and yeah, kind of sucks for free, but still they're getting their name out there. You usually want people that want to build up their portfolio and that sort of thing. That's what helps. Secondly about this, he's painted a big old target on his back that he's, definitely someone to spend a lot of money and get screwed over like he you don't want to do this and it's not best practices as a filmmaker either you want to do the most possible with the lowest amount that is the first thing that you learn in film school make the biggest best most excellent project possible without spending as much money producers do this they will hack up your film uh, rewrite your scripts just to make sure that they are doing the best project possible with the lowest amount of money possible. So most of that money goes to actors. Obviously, a portion goes to production, but there are no rules in the film. <laughs> There's no rules in the film industry. Just I have an independent filmmaker friend who has made some great independent films and has not spent money even on. 